So, willkommen zurück zu Walking Dead Season 1. Ja, Leute, ich weiß nicht, ob ihr es hört. Ich bin immer noch erkältet. Kotzt mich leicht an. Ach, jetzt mal gucken. Ah, wir haben ja gestern zwei Typen da kennengelernt. Wir nehmen uns jetzt mit. Äh, äh. Hey, Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mom was gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. Hey, Leute, ich sag euch auch gleich, ich werde nicht so viel reden. Gerade wegen meiner, <lacht> wegen meiner Stimme. Thank das, God you're okay. Dass ihr es nicht I was wearing to be müsst. bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Breaking down the way, thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. Greenies, isn't it? You've brought a couple guests. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He was her neighbor. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You, take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Yeah, I'm cool as beer with the Let's have a look. Yeah. This is swollen to hell. Could be worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. <sighs> How'd this happen? Car accident. That's so. Where are you headed <coughs> before the car accident? I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with, the girl? I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. I'm an awful nice guy. House is full up with mine. Also, Leute, got another ja, displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem... Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. Um, looking after her until we, uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we gotta reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Oh, If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. <laughs> we'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. All right, then. It smells like... 
Manure. Manure? Like when a horse plops? Just like that. <laughs> I miss my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Achso, hab ich gar nichts. Ich bin doch wieder nicht alleine unterwegs. Äh, mein Frauchen liegt neben mir. Äh, sie ist zwar am Tablet, aber trotzdem. Sie ist dann hier. Hey, get up. Mm. I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> But I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm, uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in no offense. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the <coughs> end. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Doc? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's a valuable trait lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. Dad! But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My well, family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. I'll see what the girl would like. Ah, gotta consult the missus. I understand. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And, uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. Cool. On a tractor. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. So, Leute. Jetzt, wir sind auf jeden Fall auf der Farm. Jetzt mal gucken, was hier abgeht. Hallo. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Nah, nah, no, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. <laughs> How's your son doing? Good, I think. Katya's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station, and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds, and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. See you. Yeah. Du hast Interesse an seiner Familie gezeigt. Ah, ich schwätze mir noch den. Oh, weiter hier. Oh, hi. You having a nice time with Katja Clementine? Yeah. Okay. Gut zu. Ah, mein Bein ist wieder total top, du. Muss ich ja schon sein. Oh. How you doing, Duck? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. 
Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Oh, yeah. So let's got the hand up, Satan. <laughs> My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Was the boy one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh, uh... Yep. Sometimes, it's kill, be killed. I guess. I don't think I'd sleep good after that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? Well, uh, not too close with my family. Oh. Well, they weren't in Atlanta, right? So that's good. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. <laughs> and Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Hmm. It's only show for all this. Oh, Leute, es tut mir so leid, dass die ganze Zeit anhören müsste, ob ein Fahrstuhl funktioniert von der Rotze und alles. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon, with my brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? I was being attacked and she came to my rescue. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. Yeah, not at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. What the hell? Oh, let's get up. Go! I'll get my gun! Ja, genau, erstmal dein Gewehr holen und statt hier besser mitgucken. Und sagst du nicht gerade noch raus? Kein 
schlechter Schütze. Oh je, je. Ich hasse so Entscheidungen. Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you, you didn't even try to help. I thought I could help them both. Look at him. You thought wrong. And now? Please. Just go. Get out and never come back. So there is good my Ay, ay, ay. So it's just not. You've got that ride to make it if you want it. Well, this is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. Also, fünf Leute laufen einfach so gemütlich rum, als wär's nix. Oh, ich würde da völlig Panik haben. Hey there! You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Fuck! We're trapped! No! No! Run! Jetzt würde ich sagen, sind wir erst mal safe. We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? We have kids with us. I see one little girl. What is it? I... I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. In a minute, Clem. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join them then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. She's the leader here. But it looks like she's losing control of her people. If you were in my shoes, you'd be the... Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We this gotta throw him out, there. or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. <coughs> you calm down. We kick his ass. That's what I'm thinking. Right. Everyone, chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things! What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten! That's how you turn! He's not bitten! Lee, stop this! It's upsetting him! 
Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. Sit down. Well, that's it. You're going to whoop me? <laughs> you and what homo parade? This one. <laughs> that's good. Little boy, before you eat your mommy, you can watch your dad get his nose broken. I'm going to kill him, cat. Just worry about duck. Lee. Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, when she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll turn fast. And then, there'll be three. Then we deal with it then. But right now, we're just freaking everybody out. Then get ready to deal with it, because that boy is it's bitten. not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now. No! You don't touch that boy! You don't touch anybody! I've got a little girl I'm trying to protect in here, too. You wanna get violent, you old fuck? Well, come on! You better have a plan to kill me, though, because it's me before anyone else in here! Jesus! <coughs> 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 Get away from her, you son of a bitch! Get off! So hard to go in. But no need to push. I was going to say, man. Man. Yeah. I'm going to say, it's not from Drücken. You okay? Yeah. This is great, thanks. Guys, super. Come here, Alan. Stay quiet. Wow. They're gonna get in. Shut up. Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was... Uh, uh, Dad! Ah, ah, ah. Tja, Hans Kasper. Was he the one bitten? No, don't be crazy. It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. Uh, I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. All right. Silence is consent. That's the plan. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. Larry. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. Yeah. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. So, Leute. Aber leider habe ich schon Auto gezogen. Ja. Es schaut wieder vorbei, wenn ihr weiter wissen wollt, wie es weitergeht in Walking Dead. Ich würde mich freuen, 
Ihr könnt mich gern bewerben. Negativ, positiv, wie ihr lustig seid. Über jedes freue ich mich natürlich. Bis dahin. Das sieht man sich im nächsten Part. Ich hoffe, dann bin ich wieder gesund. Also, auf rein.